Yep. Um, just over a week and a bit ago, we had uh, parts of Aylesbury flooding with the really heavy rain on the so previous Sunday. So uh, I was out with teams of volunteers putting out flood defences and manning pumps and helping to sweep up. So, uh, yeah, the weather's certainly taken a turn for the worst. Yeah, I, do you know what? I forgot about that. I meant to say to uh, my daughter, she had some really good photos of, of it. Um, but due to what's just happened in the last, obviously, couple of days, I've, I've been too busy getting all my notes and everything and trying to dig out the information to put into this broadcast. But that was, I mean, what was it, raining for seven days, wasn't it? It was it was quite a lot. I mean, the whole of the Ellsbury Vale was totally washed out, wasn't it? It was, I mean, down by the Vale, where we have live in the park, was... Yeah, the swimming pool went outdoors. For a <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, put your shorts on. Time to go for a cold dip. Yeah, well, it's, that's the positive side of it. But yeah, there, there were other estates as well that were where the streets were underwater um, over on the Willows Estate in West Aylesbury, where, where I was out on that Sunday. There were certainly a few houses that were a centimetre or two away from being flooded and literally teams of volunteers with buckets, brooms, carrying wheelie bins of, full of water away from the danger zone. We managed to, to keep them clear uh, and got the pumps in and eventually pumped all the water away. But it was, it was close call. I saw some pictures of that, I think, on, was it on the Facebook page for the Els for, well, is it the Mayor page or was it the Ellsbury? It was probably the Ellsbury District News page. All right, okay. Very, very good coverage. And there was a really great turnout of volunteers coming out to help. Well done, everybody. Not just their own neighbourhoods, but other areas as well. And I think it's probably you know, one of those other positive signs out of the recent few months that um, people have, have learned how to look out for their neighbours, be kind to each other, help out in the crisis. And when that was absolutely needed last Sunday, we saw that. We saw that in, in spades, which was great. Well done, Bucks. Well done, Ellsbury. That's quite amazing. Again, I was going to have my problems with the O2 network, so I couldn't get all my, my equipment down there and do what I need to do. But glad to hear that people mucked in and helped out. 